take sugar? Ooh, no, no, thank you. No. Here you go. Ah, well, yeah, I like to offer tea to my clients. Find it relaxes them. <laughs> well, um, yeah, I'm quite a fan of it. Okay, anyway, so following on from our previous sessions, we're gonna use a new technique called covert sensitization. Now, what this is, is you have to pinpoint and focus on all the negative consequences of stealing. Hmm, I see. You see, kleptomania in some can provoke a sense of guilt and shame towards their past actions. So it may be useful in your case to use that guilt and shame to prevent yourself from any further stealing. I've stolen far worse. Sorry, what do you mean by that? Tell me, do you believe in the devil? Uh, I, I can never really say I've ever thought about it. I feel like my sins are coming for me, that the evil is- Hey, 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 don't worry about it, okay? No one is innocent, everyone makes their mistakes. <laughs> anyway, you must, you must think I'm deranged. No, no, not at all. It's my job to help people. Believe me when I say I've helped far more intense people. Hey, listen, I don't know if it's my place to ask, but are you alright? Do I look like I'm okay? Do I look like I'm in my comfort zone? I don't know, are you okay? God, wow, this guy's sarky. Kind of say I have to admire it. Are you enjoying this? Why are you even talking to me? No, no, no. I, I, I just think I can help. You know what, mate? Go to hell. Listen, just wait, wait! What is your problem? <sighs> Anger! Letting it boil up to unimaginable levels, believing that if you isolate yourself for one single second, it'll stop yourself from engaging in reckless behaviour. But it's still there after, residing within. Never stopping, never taming. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't know me! Maybe not yet, but what I just said to you was relevant. Otherwise you would have just hit me and ran off by now. I prefer to leave that option out of the question. You really think you can help me? Sure can, if that's what you want. You know what, I, I can't get any worse, can I? So... <laughs> you know, I still can't believe that's how we first met. I mean, you must have thought I was such a twat. <laughs> you still are. <laughs> wow, just wow. No, but honestly, um, that night was extreme. I, I really don't know what would have happened if you hadn't have come along. Ah, oh, it's no problem. I saw a problem and tried to help. Now don't go get on me, all right? <laughs> you wish, mate. <laughs> mate, are you okay? Yeah, no, don't worry, I'm okay. It's just, it's just a bad headache. I guess it comes with the job, I suppose. Well, yeah, take, well, take it easy. <clears throat> Oh yeah, sorry to rush off like this. But I have to go now. But we'll meet up again soon, right? Those beers are long overdue. <laughs> Too right they are.
I feel like I'm being watched. That all I can sense is evil. I can't comprehend what is happening. Maybe it's all in my head. Maybe it's not. Hello? Hey Danny, it's me. How's it going? <laughs> hey Clary. Oh, nothing much, you know, just the usual sort of thing. What's up? I uh, just wanted to ask if you wanted to meet for a coffee sometime. Yeah, yeah, sure, sounds good. Um, let me think. You free Thursday in the afternoon? Yeah, it works for me. See you then. Great. All right, see ya. If you do that, then I'm just going to have to tear out your heart through your throat. Now that, you, you, you just wouldn't want. Believe me, it just gets so messy afterwards. And again, maybe it might be fun to play a little daring game. Maybe I'm lying. Oh, 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 I'm not a twin. No shit! So what? Know who are you and why you are in my house, hmm? Jesus, I forgot how small humans' minds are when it comes to the capacity of dealing with shock. Look, look who the hell are you? I'm got a consequence, Danny boy. Now, where were we? Give me a second. Give me a second. Oh, that's it. Now, now you, you were considering stabbing me with that knife right over there. Fine blade, very, very fine. Mm. Isn't it funny how sometimes even the weapons themselves taste like death? Look, can you please just leave? I don't want any trouble. I'll, I'll, I'll give you money. Uh, uh. You see, Daniel. In order to have a proper conversation, you have to stop stuttering and actually talk! <sighs> you're what I want, Daniel. Because you're a murderer. And for that, I want you so bad. But I'm not gonna take you right now. I mean, I could, but I won't. Because I want you to beg me to take you. Now that'll be fun. <laughs> now. Tell me, who am I? You're the devil. Got there eventually, didn't we? I'm sorry I couldn't save you. Both of you. <sighs> Suddenly like that. 
My world was cracked right open. My wife. I felt so empty. Maybe even numb to the situation. All I knew was that the world could be so unpredictable. But I didn't kill my wife. That's not why it's after me. I didn't mean to lash out. She was one of my clients and unstable. She had no one. She relied on my help. But I was only human and I... snapped. Now is not the time, Sophie, okay? For once, just realise you're not the only one who's broken. Ooh, ooh. Hello? I still can't believe I got that phone call. Sophie? You okay? Where are you? She wanted me to know what I had done. No, no! <laughs> that evening I had to choose. I didn't want to lose everything on the account of one mistake. I panicked. So I made my choice. What is it? When you saw that really big moth. Oh, come on. And you ended up screaming like a little girl. <laughs> yeah, I'm not really feeling the child of nostalgia here now, am I? Oh, and also, and when. Alright, that's enough of that. You still miss her, don't you? Of course I do. I mean, how can I not? Of course, silly question. Can't believe it's only been a year. Yeah, yeah. Go on, tell her the truth, Daniel. Tell her what kind of person you are. Tell her, Daniel. Tell her! Hey, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. I'm sorry, it was saying me to mention it, sorry. Sorry. No, 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 it's not that, but. You're scaring me, what's going on? Daniel? Imagine how easy it would be to kill her, Daniel. Ooh. Shut up, shut up! How fun it would be.
Then let's help, shall we? I'll give you one scenario. You know, family support. You know, have a wife and a kid, but oh no! That went to hell! Daniel. Then there's option two, hmm? Seek professional help. But that's kind of useless when I specialise in the area and none of it works! You are not a miracle worker! Some things just. they take time! Yeah? Well, how long do you think it's gonna take for me to forgive the fact that I couldn't even save my own wife? Or the other one? What do you mean, the other one? Look, I don't know what's going on at the moment. I, I, I really don't. But what I do know doesn't help is hearing a stupid, naive woman patronising me. You're right. I have no idea what's going on with you. I, but I know my friend's trying to help. Why well, you're not enough. Consider that. Daniel, Daniel, um, I, I need to tell you something. I'm sorry, Oliver, but now is not the time, okay? I promise we'll talk again soon, all right? Go. out of this. Oh, well, it depends on you, Danny, you know. Didn't you enjoy it, though? Didn't you find it amusing? You know, the intense chase, you know, the scared little girl in the forest. It was fun. Well, for me, mainly, I guess. Fun? You made me vision my own friend's death. You're evil. Well, it's kind of in a name, isn't it? You know, devil, Lucifer, demon king. Wait, no, scrap that. <sighs> <laughs> You're afraid to ask, aren't you? Afraid to ask that one question that you've been thinking about for a while. But too afraid to actually go to the extreme of actually asking. Why do I look like you? Well, do you want to know? <laughs> All people are selfish, Daniel. The word innocence is just a label used so people can sleep at night. Praying, hoping, I won't come for them. What do you want? Think about it, Daniel. Think about all the people, all the lives and souls I have to take. It gets tedious after a while. You just have to be an example of one of my playtime moments. What better way to play with the minds of my victims but to fall into their own body so their own darkness is reflected back at them as I slowly warp their soul. It's pretty poetic when I think about it. I can fix this. I can fix this. I can fix this. You can't run from your sins forever, Daniel! <laughs> Sorry doesn't mean anything! <laughs> oh.
Schmerzen. out of this. He's done nothing wrong. It's me you want. Come on. It gets bored if I just play with one toy. Where is he? Straight to him. Where you two first met. Forest. Damn it. What's going on? What did it do to you? He showed me that my anger could be used as an armor against everyone who's done me wrong. And you killed her? How can you live with yourself? What makes you think I can? And also, this isn't you talking, it's him. Please, come on, Fletcher. I don't want to fight you. We're friends. How things change.
what you wanted, you sick son of a bitch! <sighs> Daniel? Oh, yeah, I kind of like took your knife, you know, growing a part of me. <laughs> Wake up, Danny boy.
Oh, 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 shh, shh. What's that, Fletch? I'm sorry, he can't really talk at the moment as he's dead tired. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Why do you still try that? I mean, come on. He was my friend. Yeah. And now he's dead. Funny how things work out. But it was never meant to be this way. I'm a therapist. I'm meant to help people, not kill them. Oh. Not kill You're them. starting to break, aren't you? Guilt and empathy are massive human weaknesses. So glad I don't feel them. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. This one mistake that led you down the road to me was due to one person. This person, which I'm yet to punish, but I've been so distracted by you, I haven't had time. I mean, I'll, I'll find them eventually, but do you want to know who the person is? Uh, who is it? Your wife's killer. You remember sweet little Oliver, don't you? Your dearly departed wife left this world due to a kleptomaniac accident. I found out, of course. Tormented him. He went to you for help, but couldn't summon the guts to confess. I'm sorry, Oliver, but now is not the time, okay? I promise we'll talk again soon, all right? Go. All this time, you've been counseling your wife's killer. So I'm far worse. Now, if that ain't a twist, I don't know what is. I don't know anymore. I only know what I should do. Hang on a minute! What are you doing? You can't turn yourself in! You're mine! No, I can't risk any others! Hey, listen, I don't have much time, okay, so I'm going to make this quick. I just wanted to say you're enough. <laughs> of course you're enough, you're my best friend for Christ's sake. But I have to do something. And I know where I have to go now. I just don't want your last image of me to be a bad person. You're saying goodbye? Something like that. Do not I send my love? Bye. All this green selfishness, Daniel. Was it worth it? You're right. You've been right since the start. And no, it wasn't worth it. Those beers are long overdue. <laughs> Two right they are. Remember that time when you when you saw that really big moth? Oh come on. You ended up screaming like a little girl. <laughs>
I know who you are. I just, no, not his fault. Not his fault. Anybody but it was an accident. I didn't know. I didn't know. I heard a myth when I was young, that the devil would sometimes take human form and torment sinners on earth before claiming their souls. If any tried to resist, there would be more bloodshed. The only options you would have would be to either live in shame and disgust as the system took you in, or to accept your fate. This fallen celestial being, its malevolent influence taught me one thing. You can't run from your sins. <laughs>